Welcome back to Tennis Talk. My name's Cam Williams, and Wimbledon have just released their updated seedings list for Wimbledon for 2022. And of course, we've got a lot of players not playing. A lot of the Russian and Belarusian players are not playing. And also a lot of big withdrawals as well with injuries from the top 10 for both the men and the women. Let's go check out the women's top 10 seeds for this year. So here's the top 10 seeds for the year at Wimbledon. Of course, there's 32 seeds in all. Iga Sviantec, of course, number one seed. Konzeve is coming in at number two seed, and she hasn't actually played since the French Open. So we'll see what she can do. On she ball the number three seed, and I think behind Iga, she would be the second favorite for the tournament based on form. But Dossa comes in at number four seed. Zachary at number five. Pliskova at six. Collins at seven. Pagula at eight. Muguruza at nine. And Emma Raducanu is going to be the 10th seed at Wimbledon this year. She gets bumped up because Sabalenka is missing from that top 10 list. So they'll be the top 10 seeds for Wimbledon this year for the ladies. Having a look at the top 10 seeds for the men and, of course, some massive outs. But Novak Djokovic, despite being world number three, he'll be the top seed for this event. With Rafa coming in at the second seed. Kasper Ruud is the third seed, which I find very interesting based on his clay court form, of course. Sidzi Pass, he's the number four seed. Elkrez at five. Ojali Asim. At six, last year's semi-final is her catch at seven. Berrettini, who's probably the most informed grass court player at the moment, he's number eight. Nori comes in at nine, and Sinner comes in at number 10 seed. For Wimbledon this year, of course, we're missing Medvedev, Rublev, and Zverev out of the top 10. So a lot of players got a boost because those three players were not playing. So there you have it. They are the top seeds for this event. Of course, the draw comes out in 24 hours time. And it's going to be very interesting to see who gets placed in what part of the draw. And especially on the women's side, because we all know that WTA tennis is not as straightforward as the best players winning. Just go look at the French Open. Everybody lost in the first couple of days. Let me know down in the comments below. Who are your favorites for both the men and the women's tournaments? Because of course, Djokovic is the defending champion. Iga Fiontech, the most informed player at the moment on the women's side. But is there somebody else? Do you think Rafa playing with maybe a good foot can win Wimbledon? Do you think someone outside of the top 10 is going to win Wimbledon on both the men and the women's side? Let me know down in the comments below.